Happy AT Friday. My name is Hannah. I'm an occupational therapy student um, who has been lucky enough to be placed at Action OT for my second year placement. Um, so today I'll be talking about the Magic Wand Switch. It's a portable adaptive switch that allows somebody to operate a piece of technology or an electronic device um, using minimal movements. So it consists of the control box here uh, and the flexible metal wand. Um, this is the original version. The updated version comes with two types of wands, one that is uh, more rigid and one that is flexible. Uh, it has the option to be mounted to, a, for example, to a bed frame or um, a wall. It can be connected to anything that is switch adapted. So uh, the client that we used it for used it as a call device. Um, so I have here with me a switch adapted doorbell and a switch adapted door chime. Um, so I will show you how it works. So I have my switch adapted doorbell, plug it into the magic wand switch. Um, and basically once it's on, it will detect uh, any movement that makes contact with the wand. So if, for example, I could move as my pinky, the door chime will go off. And the wand can detect uh, uh, movements as small as two millimeters. Um, so this makes the switch useful for somebody who has very weak or limited movements. Um, the magic wand switch costs about $350 from Technical Solutions Australia, uh, plus the added cost of the switch adapted devices, whatever that may be. Um, you can also get it from Flex Equip. And the only other limitation with the Magic Wand switch is that the wand will only detect movement from bare skin. So that may be a problem if somebody can only flex, for example, their shoulder where there might be clothing. Um, so if I turn the control box onto the beep setting, you can hear the beep. Um, whereas on clothing, it just doesn't work. So um, that may be a limitation. Um, and that's the magic wand switch.